In 2012, the Colorado Springs Fire Department launched CARES, a community assistance and resource education service. The program was designed to assist those patients with chronic disease or mental health issues that were currently seeking care through the 911 system or the emergency departments and to help them access the right care at the right place at the right time. The goal of the program is to really improve overall patient health, but also allow our emergency responders and our emergency departments to be available to provide those services that they were designed to provide. Can I interrupt you and give you the non-emergency number? Our non-emergency number is, oh, okay, that number is 444-7000. You're welcome. You realize that they need the help and you want them to get the help, but I just don't think emergency services is where the help needs to come from. Resources we have in the street, we're only suited to, to help with people that have life-threatening things, cardiac arrest, trauma. Yeah, you, you feel helpless not being able to give these people what they really need. Yeah, so the chronic and episodic patient, not only do they come in and clog up the system so that we have trouble with our flow, but they add to some of the frustration because we realize that we're not giving them the care that they need at the right time and the right place. It's often very difficult to tease out for patients sometimes if the reason they're going into you know, the system calling 911 or the emergency departments might be based on a mental health or a medical condition, and for a lot of them it's both. And so as a CARES provider, um, you know, I consider ourselves, we're really the hub of the tire, and, and we have all the spokes, whether that be their mental health, substance abuse, medical care, um, and try to pull all that together. Um, so they're all communicating, they're all on the same page. I think this is a really, really exciting program. We can refer them to the, uh, the navigators that we have in the CARES division, and they're really getting them the resources and the, the care that they need. When you're outside, you get to see everything they're up against. You know, what is their housing issues? What are their finance issues? Disability, having five providers, that is even difficult for them to juggle. So it's, it's good to get into their shoes and to be able to work that process with them. I'm sure that there's a lot of people that could really benefit from the CARES program that don't have anything that would be able to get what they need, probably on a much easier basis than going and waiting hours in the emergency department or waiting to get any vista. We're working with them on what their true needs are, um, not in an episodic way, but in a connectedness into the community that um, addresses them not only in this one moment, but as the fullness of who they are as people and that connection that's needed. It's, um, I think, transformative.